And what's your name? Can you please make it out to... It's so sad. It's like everyone can see it but her. But only when it's too late. Sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you. Oh, it's all right. You got me. I'm Jo. Sandra. Please don't let me interrupt. Oh, no, you're all right. It'd be a bit weird reading it with you there. Now, I've done something stupid and I've got to disappear, but please call me if you still want to talk. And Shit, I just realised you won't even get this message because I nicked your phone. Mm. <laughs> it's mischievous and there's mystery, but perhaps it's too flippant. What's beneath the humour? That's the bit I'm interested in. What are you doing, Phil's room? Um, what? I... No, I'll, t I'll tell you later, I promise. After the workshop. I like it though. I mean, I've only just started it, but take the main character. She's gonna let herself off for Joseph, but only when it's too late. I've never thought of it like that. Oh, I'm not saying it's obvious. I mean, she's interesting because she can't see what's right under her nose. What about you? What do you write? Nothing. Well, one thing. I finished your book. And? It's so clean. So everything seemed to be building towards something, some kind of statement, but it was like you were too afraid to come out and say it. Guy, that can't have happened again. Why not? Guy! Joe, wait! Joe! My friend read it and made me apply for a place. Almost sounds like you came here by accident. <laughs> oh, I'm surprised I got a place so far so late. Still, uh, I'm glad I'm here. Jando. Oh, it's still me, you'll spill it. Joe! Joe, wait, please! Sorry about it, Leo. It's not fair. It's okay. You weren't being malicious. I'm telling you what to do. It's not right. Well, good night then. Good night. Yes. Um, sorry, what did you say your name was?